Good morning, everybody. I don't know why I'm saying that, but here where I live, it is morning, sun is shining, and we are getting closer to 2021. So far, 2020 has been a pretty interesting year, especially in the YouTube world. I mean, everyone is getting cancelled for stuff they've done in the past, and this cancel culture didn't even start this year. I think what may have started all this was back in 2019 when everyone was trying to cancel James Charles, and then this year we see influencers such as Shane Dawson being cancelled. <laughs> Like, it kind of blows my mind how these massive influencers are getting their careers ruined because of some old tweets they made back in 2012. But of course there will be YouTubers such as this gnome right here who will do anything to get your channel taken down. I guess if you really want to do all of this YouTube stuff or just be an influencer in general, you should probably go ahead and delete all of your posts on Twitter, Snapchat, Facebook, or whatever social media platform you're on. Because people are going to find out about your past. Even all the weird tentacle porn you've been watching is going to get you exposed. I am sure we all watching that so why don't we all go ahead and clear our search history right guys but i mean at least 2020 hasn't been a boring year when it comes to the online world if you had to ask yourself what your favorite meme this year had been for you what would it be i'd probably go with all the parasitical memes but i'm sure you guys are aware of that recently to those who are unaware I've been grooming a 15 year old boy when I was 19. I'm a sexual predator. I took advantage of him and I knew his age all along. But what's your favorite meme of the year? Comment down below. Also, can we talk about the fact that memes this year has gotten to a point where they're so bizarre and has absolutely no explanation? Like you get it the dank memes were a thing back in 2018, but I mean, this year is something else, man. Someone in my Discord chat literally sent a video of a bunny called Big Chungus fighting Shaggy from Scooby-Doo. What the fuck, man? And then this bunny pulls out a uno card that says plus four and literally clones himself into a huge army of bunnies you know what i'll i'll just play the clip for you because this shit can't be explained this is the case of something being funny simply due to the fact that it's so weird and stupid anyway let's talk about our beloved turkey tom so i'm not gonna sit here and overuse the joke about him being a lie just because his name says turkey even though he's not really a turkey like lamau guys what the fuck man if we look at his youtube account he has lost more than 10,000 subscribers within a few days and it's funny because people chose him that they would unsubscribe to him if he kept making videos like he did in his response video to which he responded with go ahead i don't want you and it's funny because people took that pretty serious like quite literally who knows guys maybe the only thing this guy could do to redeem himself would be to do a giveaway once he hits 180k subs <laughs> And yeah, you guys just, just keep doing your thing with the beaded lyrics. You don't really seem to stop anytime soon. At this point, it is honestly just cyber warfare between two fan bases, just where one of the fan bases is much stronger than the other. Like, it, it really ain't fair for Turkey Tom. Now, what I really wanted to talk about was the fact that... Well, as you guys know, back when I was 14, I was groomed by Turkey Tom. And it was something I had been quiet about because I felt powerless. I've been sitting thinking about this non-stop, being angry, confused, and sad that I've had to accept this since I was 14. I mean, I was intimidated by... by his big-ass forehead. No wonder why he knows so much about people's past. This man literally got unlimited memory with that thing. But back to what I was saying, Turkey Tom groomed me, and I have proof. So over the past couple of days, I will admit it was kind of hard to find any proof that this ever took place. I've been looking through my Discord conversations with him, I've been asking the mighty Reddit mods to help him with the situation. But I guess that didn't work out, so I did something else. I've created something that proves Turkey Tom's guilt and how he groomed me. I've created a Google Docs. This document that I've created basically only shows one side of the story and nothing else. It's fully biased and 100% the truth. I mean, look at it. It literally says that Turkey Tom groomed me when I was 14. You don't have to believe me, but all I'm saying is that this is proof. Guys, that is going to be it for today's video. Thank you for making it all the way till the end. I really do appreciate it. Don't leave yet. I'll give you two seconds to hit the subscribe button and join the best friend club. Also, if you're interested in joining my Discord server, there will be a link in the description for that. Come by and send us your favorite meme and you'll probably get one back. Once again, thank you if you made it this far into the video. Comment if you did. Until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.